Morning guys, how are we doing? Welcome to today's video and I've got to be honest with you, I'm really, really looking forward to this one simply because I'm a dog lover, an animal lover and uh, I found, well not found, I was told about a dog cafe here in the city. So I'm going to go up there and uh, see what's going on and uh, have a play, have a play and see where we are. So right now I'm outside Honey 3, uh, this is here, sorry, the Grand Honey 3 Body Massage, which is located right opposite the entrance in there to Soy Bacal. So we're on South Patea Road. South Patea Road meaning if you go down that way, you follow it all the way down, eventually you will come to Second Road. And if you kept going again, eventually you will come to Beach Road. And uh, your grid reference up there, you see there just on the McDonald's sign, that is Tookcom, that's where we are. So we're gonna head up this way. Uh, I've never been here before. I've not got uh, much idea as to what to expect. I believe, I understand there are, uh, I believe I understand there are lots of uh, dogs there to have a bit of fun with. Uh, over there is Grand Honey Body Massage. If you haven't had a body massage, uh, we call it a soapy. If you haven't had one when you come out here, try it. You know, just try it. There's uh, quite a few here. It's an experience. Let's leave it at that. It's an experience. But what we're going to do is we're going to head up here. And uh, I'm going to go down Soy 11. Hello. Uh, um, yeah, we're going to go up there to Soy 11 across the road there. See there, the World Time Wellness Centre. You may have seen my video. Uh, where I discussed about the fact that uh, when you talk about uh, evening performance um, right now, at the moment I'm struggling, having said that, when I made the video, uh, that was my situation right now. There seems to be signs of improvement and uh, my wife will be down soon. So let's see, maybe she'll notice a difference. My little pecker will be pecking, who knows, I don't know. But anyway, the point being is that uh, so far so good. Uh, over there, friendship, if you like all your home comfort foods, uh, your delicatessen and all that kind of stuff. Uh, go in there, guys. Very, very good. And they've got a massive range of stuff in there. Massive range, so uh, you won't be short of uh, choices. But we're going to head up here to Soy 11. And uh, you may have seen that the gentleman that owns this is the same gentleman I did the snake cafe. Do you remember I did the snake cafe? And uh, he, um, he got that, which I thought was a really novel, really interesting concept. Uh, but also he's got this one here which is called the Dog Cafe and like I say I've never been there so I don't know what to expect, I've got no idea where we are with it but uh, I'm sure it'll be good and if you're a dog lover like myself well then it's a no-brainer uh, where are I? See, I'm, I'm on my phone, look, I'm on my phone and it ain't, it ain't tracking where I'm moving, why is that? anyway, not to worry Soy 11 uh, 38 Soy Potato Tie 11 gotta be up here somewhere We'll find it, don't worry. Made me laugh the other day, I had a guy send me a message and uh, he said, Trevor said, why don't you structure your videos more professionally? Why don't you detail what you need to do and organize it? And I think to myself, do you know what, in all honesty, I don't want to be the BBC, I don't want to be professional. The way I figure it out in my head, rightly or wrongly, is that if I was walking with you now, like we're doing, and I'm like, right, come on, mate, let's go and have a look at this dog cafe. And we got lost. Well, then we'd get lost. So I, I just try and keep it a bit real, if I'm being honest. Maybe that's not the right thing to do. Maybe I should do uh, tie it up and make it as professional as I can. But uh, I don't know. That's just my style. Right. Here we are. Soy 11. There you go. There's a sign up there. Let me show you that. And we're going to go to a dog cafe which should be down here. Uh, there's a driving school. That's quite novel, isn't it? With the, uh, the, the driving ability out here, there is the driving school. Right, let's go and figure out this dog cafe. I think it's up here in front of me, actually, looking at it. I recognize the sign. Oh yeah, there we go, the dog club. And like I say, the gentleman that owns this, he's got the um, Creep and Crawl, the snake cafe, which was on Second Road. That was fun. Never had any idea that snakes weren't slimy. I always thought, oh, hello. Um, I always thought snakes were slimy, but they, these are uh, the bell python, and uh, the skin was really dry, really weird texture. But here we are. There's the dog club potato sign, and we are going to go in here. We're going to enter here, and I can see lots of dogs already. Look at them, look. Oh, how cool is this? Good morning, sir. How you doing? Oh, look at these. Oh, God, I can't wait. Which way do I go in? Through here? Look, look. I've got a welcoming party. 
How beautiful is he? Good morning, boss. How are you doing? Good morning. How, How are you? You okay? Yeah, I'm good. Good, right. Today is dog day. No snakes today. <laughs> no snakes no today. Right. Oh, I love dogs. Okay, I've got to rest it. Right, one second, guys. I've got to put some socks on. Right. Hello, fellas. Hello, mate. Wow, look at all these. Look, oh man, this is brilliant. Oh, hello, fella. How are you doing, mate? You okay? She's just about nine months old. Nine months old. Oh, bless. What's your name? What's your name? This is brilliant. Oh, no, look over here. Hello, fellas. Oh, hello. Oh, <laughs> hello. Oh. oh, you remind me of my ex wife. Hello, fella. Oh, we're having a bit of a... This is brilliant. Oh, how pretty are you? You okay down there? You okay? Now, if you're a dog lover, oh, no, look, look, look. Hello, mate. <laughs> Hello, dude. How many dogs have we got? How many dogs do you have? Uh, actually, 16, but... 16? Right now, it's 12. Okay. And some we have to switch in the afternoon. Oh, do you? Yeah. It's oh, a bit like only three that we switch. It's a basset hound. Oh, that is the beagle. A beagle? Oh, is it a beagle? Yes. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Why are you nipping his ear? What are you doing? Why are you having a chew on his ear? Don't do that. Hello. You are handsome, you are. Guys, you got to come and check that. I love dogs. This is brilliant. Now, these two are having a barley down there, look. All right, chill out, dude. Don't make, listen, if you're gonna bite him, don't bite my nuts. Right, oh. Oh. Pfft. Wow. So, in terms of the cafe, what, uh, what time do you open every day? We open at uh, 11 o'clock to about 7.15. 11 to 7.15? Actually, actually, we open to, uh, from 11 o'clock to 7.30. 11 to 7.30. But the dog needs to go, to go back for supper. Oh, at, yeah. At 7.15. And they all get on so well, even though they're having a bit of a rough and tumble over there, but they get on well. And every day, every day open? Oh, uh, we open every day. Oh, no, except Wednesday. Except Wednesday, right. So Wednesday we're closed, guys, but open every day. And uh, in terms of the concept, so people can come in here, they can interact with the dogs. Yeah. Um, you just come and play with our dogs. Brilliant. Oh, I think he wants to get a drink. <laughs> the price, the entrance fee is just 300 baht. 300 baht to you come in. You get one free drink. With the drink, yeah. With the drink, with the... A little bag of dog treat. Oh, okay. And also the Polaroid photo. And you get a photo as well. Hello. Polaroid. I want to go and say hello to this one over here. Oh, look, look, look. <laughs> Come on, son. Give it some. <laughs> See, when you're in Patea, what, it, it, that's it, he's done there, he's finished. See you later, mate. <laughs> hello, beautiful. Hello. They are all males. They're all males. <coughs> I thought one would, yeah. This one is female and this one. Brilliant, these two are having a right old pop at each other. And all the dogs are really friendly, they're really nice. Look at this dog, beautiful. You are stunning, you are beautiful. Hello, what's your name? Hey, you okay buddy? Beautiful. This is quite popular. Yeah, I can imagine. And uh, we've got one over here just, just chilling out. You okay, buddy? You just taking it in your stride? He says, I can't be done with all this camera stuff. Go, go away. Oh, is he? Bow, bow, bow. Bow, bow, go on in. Off you go, buddy. Oh, okay. So you, oh, so you can sit against there and take a photo. Yeah, we like. Do you take a photo for customer? The polo photo. Oh, the dog club today. Yeah, gotcha. Brilliant. This is quality, guys. This is brilliant. Again, you know, just remember when I showed you about the Creep and Crawl, the Snake Cafe? And, you know, these are different things that you can come and experience here. They're, they're you know, not the same old, same old as you'd expect. And these dogs are beautiful. Oh, look at this dog. I've got to get it. I've got to get it. Can I get a picture of you, my friend? Hello, baby. Look at that. Oh, give me a kiss. Beautiful. Yeah, absolutely beautiful. There you are, guys. If you're into dogs, if you like your animals like me, I'm a dog lover. Look at these two down there, look. These two are having a right go eat. There we go. Oh, hello, they're joining now. Three. 
But if you like it, you know, it's a big area, big spacious cafe, and uh, you've got a full drinks menu. So you can come up here, and uh, you can see up there you've got uh, the Italian sodas, the uh, other drinks, milk, honey, tea, coffee, all those kind of things. And uh, there's the prices there, very good, very, very good. Right, I'm gonna sit down and have a play for a while, and then I'm gonna head off and uh, we'll walk a bit further around in the, uh, in the area. Look at this, look. look. You just can't do that. Those over there, they're, they're, they're probably having a ding dong. You're too old, aren't you? You can't be bothered. Right, back in the bit. That was brilliant. And uh, definitely right up my street. If you're an animal lover like myself, I love the dogs, the, the lovely animals. I've got two myself, as you know. I've got Ben and August. And uh, in there, that was just great. It's just something, and it's literally just off the walk there, as I showed you. So uh, we're going to head off. I'll, I'll keep going up and we'll have a little wander around. And then we'll wrap the video up. But let me just spin around here. And uh, like, uh, like you explained it, it's a 300 baht entrance fee, but you get a drink with that as well. And also you get a bag of food to feed the dogs and they are shut on a Wednesday. So they're open every day, 11 a.m. until 7.30 in the evening. Right, let's head off. That was brilliant. I really, it's weird, isn't it? You know, you, you go around the city and we kind of like, just think everything's, you just kind of think like everything's the same, same. But there's so many different things, so much variety and very different things here. It really is quality and uh, definitely, Pop up, guys, come up. Those dogs are great fun. I had a right laugh. I was playing for ages with them. There was two of them were having a, having a rough and tumble. A couple of them were just sitting there thinking, oh, I can't be bothered. And there was one that was really fun, just kept uh, coming up and licking me and jumping up. Really, really nice. But come, come up, guys. Like I say, soy, 11. And uh, easily to find. Very, very easy. Get yourself down here onto the South Potato Road. And once you're on South Potato Road, just uh, come out of the Soiba Cow exit, turn left, head up past the Well Time Clinic, keep coming, and eventually you'll get up here. See where the pizza, there's the pizza company there. Uh, where the pizza company is, we are opposite. We are right opposite. So that's the pizza company, and you're just gonna walk down there until on the left-hand side there. And uh, remember, we are at Soy 11. That's where we are, right. Let's have a walk for a a little bit and then uh, we'll wrap today's video up. It's nice today, it's quite warm. The sun's been out for a while. We've had a few hot days lately, which is uh, nice. Did have a bit of rain the other week. And people saying, oh, is it, is it gonna rain the rainy season? The nice thing about the rain here is when it does rain, and it happens, you know, when it does rain, you get the odd days. It's a bit of a downpour, but then it clears itself up. And just up here, here's the pasta factory. Uh, I did a video in there the other day. Food was lovely. Like your steaks, they do a special. Effect. There you go. Let me just show you. Please check before you come down, guys, on their website for the special of the day. But this one, I have this promotion of the month. There you go, M month. Sliced Wagyu beef, rump steak, homemade tagliatelle, cognac, green pepper, the cream sauce, grilled mushrooms, and garlic bread with gratinate with grand panda, pandano, 500 it was brilliant. It was really, really nice. Oh, oh so you just popping out there. You know? and, uh, if you need to go, you need to go. Bless him. <laughs> he, he caught me short there, I don't know what to say. I'll tell you what, uh, over here, um, if you like your, uh, your vegetarian food, uh, let's get across. Let's see. All right, cool. Yeah, up here, five star. Been in there many times. And they're uh, the Massaman, the Massaman curry they do. Oh, it is just top, top draw. However, it is a vegetarian restaurant. You'll see it in a second, I'll show you. Uh, where are we? Right, here you go. Five star J. Homes at midday, closes at nine. No MSG, no trans fats, no chemicals, no onion or garlic, no refined sugar, no palm oil. And I like to say, I've been in there a few times, I've eaten in there a few times, very, very nice. The Massaman curry they do, oh, brilliant. It's Five Star J. Right on the very junction. We're right on the very uh, crossroads here. That up ahead is South Potato Road. This is Third Road in front of us. And down there, that takes you down to South Potato Road to the beach. So there you are, that's where Five Star is. So I'll have a little walk up here for a bit. And then we'll wrap it up. Need to go and get some food. I wonder why they don't have onion and garlic. 
I don't know why that is, truthfully. Yeah, there's a question, guys. Help me out. Why in a, in a vegetarian restaurant do they not use onion or garlic? I should go in and ask, actually, but, uh, but yeah. I'm not sure why that's really. They're both vegetables, aren't they? Surely they are, yeah. Of course they are. They come out of the ground. Got to be a vegetable. Anyway, I don't know. Uh, here you go. Co Cement, beautiful. Co Good, oh, stunning. Co Mac, not been there. Co Wine, not been there. Co Chang, yep, nice. I'm going to start doing a load of tours. I'm heading off doing my bits and pieces. I've only gone and got myself a car now, so uh, no excuses. I can drive distances. I can't, uh, can't make the excuse that it's just my little moped. My moped's having a bit of TLC. There's uh, a guy who uh, I've been recommended to who rebuilds, rebuilds motorbikes. And uh, as you know, my moped's just, well, it's, it's a bone shaker. So I'm going to get it back and uh, very soon. And there's no shaking anymore. It's going to be like brand new. Quite excited. I'll show you when I get it, when I'll put it on the video. You won't recognise it. Going to be all singing, all dancing. It's funny isn't it, how things, when, you, when you, things trigger you, it's like here. I saw that green dress then. It just reminded me of Ian. I met him the other day. He's, uh, he's all right, he's doing well. And uh, it's good to see him. We actually we had a good chat. And uh, it's nice to see him again. He's, uh, he's currently doing some stuff for uh, the Bullet Group. And a uh, great guy, great guy. And I remember when I very first met him, <laughs> he lost a bet. And uh, the, the day I met him was on one of our bar meetups. And uh, he came walking down LK Metro in a bright green dress. Because <laughs> him and his mate Russ. Russ, if you're watching, mate, love you to death, buddy. Can't wait to see you again. Uh, but yeah, he, he lost a bet, so he had to wear a bright green dress all the way down LK Metro. It was hilarious. But fair play to him, he did it. He did it. So this end of town here, uh, where I'm walking now, to be honest with you, there's not really much happening to be fair. There's not a lot. Um, this is kind of like stretching away from the main city now, so you're kind of almost getting into like real life, I suppose, away from the tourist, from the holiday making life. Uh, over there, prestige properties, they deal in high end, high end properties. When I was looking for somewhere, I went there, but uh, they were high, high end, like, uh, out of my budget range. I think they, uh, I think they were looking at properties from like 35 to 40,000 baht a month upwards. But nevertheless, very nice properties. Oh, yeah, that's Steve, is it Steve McQueen? Is it Steve McQueen did that video? When he jumped over the fence? That's the trouble, isn't it? When you get old, and I'm old, and my brain's not working properly, Although I'm taking uh, some medication for that now, trying to try and get my grey matter back into grey, rather than at the moment, I think it's like pale white. But um, yeah, I think it's, uh, I forget a lot of things. It does worry me if I'm being truthful. I'm not going to lie. My body's falling apart. And uh, how am I going to see? Uh, here, look at this, look. Cheers for that, mate. Nice one. Thank you. Well, they blocked the road off. It's all right for me, I can climb over. But what about an old person that can't? Then they've got to walk out into the road. Why can't you be a bit more considerate for other people? But no, yeah, I'm falling apart. I've been down to the World Time Clinic and I videoed that. If you didn't see it, have a look back. It's only recent. And uh, I'm, on, I'm on medication to try and, uh, try and put a smile on my wife's face. My brain's not remembering stuff. So I'm taking this, uh, I can't remember the name of it now. I'm taking a, a, a vitamin tablet, a herbal tablet, to try and uh, inc increase my memory or, or stimulate my brain a bit more. Because unfortunately, it's uh, not very good. And it's weird, you know, when you, when you get these situations, I don't know about you guys, if you're suffering with anything like I am, but you start thinking all the worst. You start building up all these weird and wonderful thoughts in your head. Oh, maybe I've got this, maybe I've got that. So I don't know, I might just be old. I'm just just be old and uh, done and dusted. Anyway, I'm waffling on now. <coughs> Soon when I get my bike back, it, will, well, not, it won't be red, but it will be as one, it'll be nice and new, can't wait. Okay, so this is Third Road. Not much going on really, it's the middle of the day. I think really we should uh, 
wrap it up. But like I say, you know, the dog cafe, guys, go in there, go and pop in. Go and support him, he's a really nice guy, generally nice guy. And uh, the dogs, as you saw, were good fun. They were good fun. So if you're an animal lover, like myself, then uh, you know where to head off to. Soy 11, South Potato Road. Go in there and have a bit of fun for an hour. They were really nice. Right, I need to find somewhere to finish the video off. Uh, I'll tell you what we'll do while walking to me. All right, so that's it today, guys. I uh, hope you've enjoyed today's video, something a bit different. And like I say, you know, for those animal lovers out there, perfect, absolutely perfect. Okay, thank you very much for watching, guys. Please, as always, remember, hit the subscribe button and also the bell icon if you'd like to be notified when I bring out a new video. Uh, have a look on my Instagram. Instagram is all about nightlife, the girls, the bars, etc. Uh, what I would ask, guys, is please, if you do jump on Instagram, please click the follow, the, 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 uh, the follow button only because it just helps me when I'm talking to bars and stuff and now uh, asking them for content they can see that we get good views and that uh, we've got a lot of people that follow us so please would you do that likewise on TikTok uh, have a look on TikTok that's more about daytime stuff uh, restaurants beaches all that kind of things tourist attractions so have a look on that I found my stuff here Whew. yes have a look on that one guys and uh, I forgot what I was going to say now. oh yeah Discord uh, have a look on our Discord, there's over 17,800 members on there. Totally free of charge, great platform, lots of information. And uh, you can use it as a, a really good resource to figure out what's going on right here, right now in the city. And if you'd like to support the work I do, please send me an email, 247 at gmail.com. Uh, your support is much appreciated. It allows me to go off and do different things and uh, bring different content to the channel. Okay, thank you very much for watching, guys. And please, as always, wherever you're in the world, stay safe.